Use models to add lesson 8.5. Models can help us add ones or tens to a two-digit number. We can add ones to a two-digit number using models. We have 34 plus 3. We use three rods of 10 and four units for four ones. We need to add three. We can just count the three tens and we can group the ones together. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 34 plus three is equal to 37. We can add tens to a two digit number. Here we have 34 again. We have three tens and four ones. We want to add 20. That's two tens. We can group the tens together into one big group. We don't group the ones. And we have one, two, three, four, five tens. And we have one, two, three, four ones. 34 plus 20 is 54. We can draw to show how to add the ones. We can write the sum. We can use a long blue bar for a bar of 10, and we can use little dots for our units of one. We have 24, that's two tens and four ones, plus four more ones. We have two tens, and we have four, five, six, seven, eight ones. 24 plus 4 is equal to 28. We group the ones together and count them all together and get a total. Two tens and eight ones. 16 plus 3. We can add 16 plus 3. We have one ten and six ones plus three more ones. We can group the ones together. We have one ten and we have six, seven, eight, nine ones. 16 plus three is equal to 19. Let's try it one more time. We have 72 plus six. We have seven blue bars to make seven tens and we have two red dots for the two ones and we're adding six so we have six dots. We can add the ones by grouping them together. We have seven tens and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ones. 72 plus six is equal to 78. We can draw to show how to add the tens. We can write the sum. We have 18 plus 40. We use one long bar for a 10 and we have eight ones for the 18. And we have four tens for the 40. We can group the tens together. The ones stay outside and we have one, two, three, four, five tens. And we have the eight ones. 18 plus 40 is equal to 58. Let's try it again. We have 40 plus 45. We can group the four tens and the four tens together. We have four, five, six, seven, eight tens. We have the five ones. 40 plus 45 is equal to 85. We can make a sum of 67, draw a quick picture, write the number sentence. We need to add ones to a two-digit number. So we need a two-digit number. And it says to add only ones, no tens. So we can only have zero to seven ones because that's how many ones are here. So we can add seven as the ones and our two-digit number, now that we took those seven ones away, we have zero ones, we can add it to 60 and do seven plus 60 is equal to 67. We could have used six 
plus 61. We could have used 5 plus 62. As long as we were adding a one-digit number to a two-digit number. See? We can add tens to a two-digit number so that it equals 67. We can take some tens away from here. We have six tens. We can put two tens here as a 20. If we take two of them away, that's going to leave four tens. So that would be 20 plus 47. We could even do 30 plus 37. We could do 10 plus 57. That would be adding a 10 to a two-digit number, and that would equal 67 and make it true. Choose a way to solve, draw or write to show your work. Bob picks 48 cherries, then he picks 40 more. How many cherries does Bob pick? So we can draw bars for the four tens and the eight ones. We can put little dots for the 48, and we can draw four bars for the 40 more, four more tens. We can group and add the four tens and the four tens. That will give us eight tens, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then we can add the eight ones. Eight tens plus eight ones is equal to 88. We can also look at it as 40 plus 40 by adding the tens, that's equal to 80, and then add the eight little ones, and that would be 88. Doesn't matter what order we add them in, we'll get the same amount, 88 cherries. Emma has two plates of cupcakes. She wants to put a cherry on top of each cupcake. It doesn't tell us how many cupcakes are on the plate, does it? It just tells us that she has two plates. She uses 10 cherries for each plate. Emma has four cherries left. How many cherries did she have to start? So there were two plates of cupcakes. She needed 10 cherries for each plate, and then she had four left over. So what we can do is we can draw a plate and draw the 10 cherries she used and draw another plate, the second plate, and draw the 10 cherries she used. And then she had four left over, and we can add them all together. 10 plus 10 plus 4. That's 110 plus 110. That makes two tens plus four ones. She had 24 cherries. It's important we label what they were. Okay? 24 cherries. That's how many she had when she started. Our next lesson is going to be make 10 to add. That's lesson 8.6. And we're coming up very soon on using place value to add tens. Keep working on your math. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.